She is Kathy Raley, and she joins us here on the All Access Post Game Show on the Mustang Sports Network. Coach, um, I guess we kind of both have to be bad cops today, unfortunately. Yeah, That's the way cop. that it goes. You're going to be a good cop? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Um, I, I guess take me through. Let's start by saying the team that you played today is a really, really good team. There's no doubt about that. A absolutely. Um, I, I, for as sad as I am that we lost this game today, I am really happy with some of the developments we made throughout the game, both offensively and defensively. Um, when you're dealing with a young team, against a majority of team who has seniors, uh, those things are going to happen. The difference is today were the 50-50 balls. You can't expect to ha you know, have a turn, something go wrong and have Messiah pick up the ball. And when Messiah does something wrong, Messiah picks up the ball. That can't, it's got to, you got to at least get those 50-50 opportunities. If we can cut down on those numbers, if we can, if we're going to turn the ball over or make a mistake, let's get it back. Let's get back missed shots. Then I think we can take this team in April. Mm. Well, we actually discussed that. <laughs> Glenn asked <laughs> me throughout the broadcast, could this team then be yeah. Messiah? And I said, absolutely, no doubt about that. I agree 100% with you. Yeah, two, two things need to happen. We need to get a little more, uh, a little better shot selection, I think, and, and possess a little longer. And it doesn't hurt to have a hot goalie. And, and we had a hot goalie today. No and, and I think we'll have a hot goalie again come April. Yeah, she has certainly proved herself, yes. and we'll talk to her here in a second. Yes. Uh, clearing. You knew what you were going to be up against in their pressure, and that was as advertised. Um, you, you expected it. It mm -hmm. obviously didn't go the way that you wanted it to go. What needs to improve there? Well, uh, we're going to get our box players in for another practice. We keep having to bring them in separately and, and get them to understand how to work the box. We still don't know how to work the box efficiently. So that's got to change. That is priority one. Priority two would be um, you. maybe it was a mistake keeping Jamie back low. What I was hoping is Jamie would put pressure on the run and draw people and then we would open up the middle. And what it did is she was happy to stay behind the play. We, we need her in the midfield transition. So that's something that became clearer to us as the game went on today. One thing you'll be glad to hear. Yes. And these are your statistics, statistics I have yes. in my hand. Oh, I to they, give to see, you. I, I can't believe there's anything <laughs> However, glad to hear no, on that. Right. So <laughs> in the second half, mo you increased your statistics in most categories. It's, I think so. So, yeah. for example, your clear is 6 mm -hmm. for 12 in the first mm -hmm. half, 8 for 12 in the second right. half. You took almost twice as many shots in the second sure. half as you did in the first sure. half. Matt Ferguson actually made more saves what? in the second half <laughs> than she did in the first yes. half. And she had an incredible first yes. half. So lots of bright spots actually actually throughout yeah. the course of the game. And I think so too. I think defensively, we made them work hard for every goal that they had. We really did. We were often causing the ball to hit the ground. They were just picking it up. Mm -hmm. If we can change that one component of the game, if we could pick up when we disrupt their play, if we could pick up the 50-50, this game goes the other direction yeah. quickly. Obviously, Coach Messiah game that you circle on the calendar when yeah. the season begins, but you, you can't rest up now, right? Like, you, you need to keep that intensity moving right. forward as you get into the heart of conference play. We're ready to run through this conference. We're ready to work hard. Every team we see is going to be a challenge. Lebanon Valley, Albright, um, Widener, they're, they're all going to be a challenge for us. Uh, we got to go and play hard every game. We are going to look at the mindset that every game is Messiah from here on out, and what would we do in those occasions? We got a young team. They don't know any better to sit back and relax, so they're going to go hard at everything, which is going to make this. This is my favorite chunk of the season here because I think we're going to really develop some offensive tendencies now. Well, it all starts Wednesday at Lebanon Valley. Yes. Coach, uh, good luck, and we appreciate you coming up. We'll see you Thank next you. Saturday. Thank you very much. Thank you. Coach Kathy Rayla joining us here on the All Access Post Game Show now.